Hey everybody, welcome back. How are you? I hope you are all saying happy and healthy. Uh, I'm just gonna get into it. I have for you a little bit of a haul unboxing of an order I made a long, long time ago from the brand Be So Lovely. As you may know, the, you may have already seen it, maybe you haven't. I did, did I upload it? Hopefully. I <laughs> recorded at least a video of my first unboxing from Be So Lovely. It was technically my second order, but it was the first one that got to me and arrived, so I did a little crappy unboxing there. And it's actually still over there, like the boxes are over there and everything. And I love it, and so today, it's a different box. <laughs> So it's not as pretty, but it still has a little ribbon on it, so that's cute. So I'll open up what I got here. This is technically my first order, but I received it second. Because some things were... I think it was like a material issue, but they were waiting on some stuff for the pieces. So here we go. Oops. And I spent a lot of money on it, and I've waited a very long time. Um, it was already going to be pre-ordered, but even so, there was a couple emails saying... Oh, the, these pieces are going to be delayed. Update, these pieces are still delayed. I'm like, but they're so pretty. I want to see them now. <laughs> the impatience definitely uh, hit me pretty strongly. But they're here now, and they actually came a day earlier than I thought they would. They were supposed to come tomorrow, but instead, it's today. So, that's really exciting. Also, my earrings on today are from Basura Gang. Little chickies with the uh, little knifies. Anywho, enough about that. We're gonna get into this part. Should I have undone the ribbon? I don't know, but I did anyways, so. I feel like it's going to be not as nice of a, an experience just because the box is like a plain box, but it's okay. And I think also because they were saving those light up jewelry boxes for like special, I think like customs, so it's not gonna be as special and as as much of an experience this time around, but it'll still be nice because the pieces are still gorgeous. Oh, it's still pretty nice! Oh my gosh! Okay, so here we be. Here's the Be So Lovely card again. Cute! A little holiday Christmas print. I guess I should say it's Christmas. It's Be So Lovely with little rings. How cute! Oh my gosh! And then <laughs> I did get a card capture Sakura piece, and then I got two Sailor Moon inspired pieces, so that's exciting. Oh, so cute. I do kind of regret not buying from her Black Friday sale and getting a few of those pre-orders in, but I just, I don't have the money, so there we go. I bought these quite a long time ago, so. So cute. Ta-da! these are all whoa oh that one just kind of came out oh my god i'm so excited okay Ooh, all right that one just opened up on me and i thought what was in it and i'm so excited this is a business card once again so nice and that's it this time it came in these cute little pink gift boxes i am once again a little sad i don't get another light up box but that's okay Let's pop this one. It's so pretty. All right, here's the first thing, and it's the Luna transformation ring. Can you kind of see it? Oh, I'm so excited. Ooh. And I got in a size six, so hopefully that's my size. Oh, it's so pretty. Look at that. Oh my gosh! I personally like wearing rings on my middle finger, so... Oh, that's so pretty. Oh my god, that is so pretty. So yeah, it's way too big for my ring finger. I must be like a 5 on my ring finger, but my middle finger <laughs> is good. Oh my god, that's so pretty. Ah, oh, if only I had my nails did. I really miss having my magical girl nails when I was in Tokyo like three years ago or whatever. Oh. Okay, that's so beautiful. All right. Wow. Okay, the weight is well, well deserved. Oh my gosh, that's so beautiful. Okay, next. Which one? Which one? Let's see this one. This one's probably the, the thing I already saw. Yes. All right. So, uh, which this one was? Okay, 
There we go. Ta-da! And this is the Luna Choker. Oh my god, it's so pretty. Oh my god, it's so pretty. Oh my gosh. And here's, here's the rest of it. I gotta be careful, otherwise I'm gonna ruin it. And then I'll cry. Okay. Oh my gosh. Crisis. Tape goes on my leg. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, I messed it up already. Okay. Oh my god. Why can I not function as a, an actual normal human adult? Okay, here we go. <sighs> this is the struggle. I can't... <laughs> I struggle with, like, all layered necklaces, so I don't know why I thought this was a good idea, but here we are now. Ta-da! There it is. In all of its glory, it has little... jemmy bits on here. I'm really good at describing it. And it's got little stars. Star charms on it. Oh, it's so cute. It's, again, a tiny little, little thing here. Super, super dainty. It is shorter than the Inuyasha one. Oh my gosh and much like the inuyasha one i keep getting it entangled in itself <laughs> that is the one downside to these pieces is that since they are so dainty um they do get tangled pretty easily but well oh, chokes myself on the choker not supposed to do that Okay, hello, I cannot figure this out on my own. <laughs> there we go. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh gosh, so tangled. Oh, so pretty. Oh my gosh. Okay, I will try to get, you know what, where's my phone right now? I'm gonna, <laughs> you might judge me for this, but I don't care. Oh wow. Oh wow. Am I gonna get a good shot of this? Oh, it's <laughs> You're gonna see. <laughs> We're gonna record it right now. This is where I'm at right now. This is gonna be video inception, maybe. Look at it. Oh my gosh. It's so pretty. And it's so dainty. It is definitely, I think, higher than the Inuyasha one. Oh my gosh. Alright. <laughs> Inception. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's all right. Okay, alright. I gotta stop recording this now. <laughs> oh my gosh, that is beautiful. I am so hyped. Alrighty. It's got three little star charms, two little gem bits, and then the main. Once again, besides it also being really dainty and easy to tangle, it is also a very small clasp, so if you have issues with that, just a caution. Like, it's super tiny, but it is really beautiful, and ma'am, can you not? <laughs> oh my gosh, it's so pretty. And then on the back, I think it has, yeah. On the back, it has Be So Lovely on it. On the main piece. You can't see it. Why am I doing that? Anywho. Oh, so pretty. Oh, so pretty. I am gonna feel like a fancy bitch. I just wish it didn't tangle so easily. <laughs> I know on another post they mentioned how one necklace wasn't going to be a, a layered one because they had issues with it tangling up too much. I think that's kind of an issue with all of their layered necklaces. But is that gonna stop me from wearing them? No, it is not. I'm super excited to wear that. Okay, put it in the box. Gently in the box. And then last, 
but not least is Ta -da! the card captor sakura set wow i'm an idiot first of all no i'm not i was right <laughs> my brain now let's try these on So here's one, super, super tiny. Here's the other one. You can kind of see it. Oh, wow. And then they go like this. Oh my gosh. Look how pretty. Oh my god. That is so pretty. I kind of thought it would be a little bit more yellow, like the center would be, but you know what? She is pretty nonetheless. Let's get a flashlight on that. Ooh. Yeah, maybe it's the lighting that made it look not as great. Oh yeah, you can totally see what I'm talking about. <laughs> okay, well now I want to put the flashlight on everything. Anyways, that is fantastic. I love this. I have a few rings, but they're all like cheap rings, so then they like tarnish and everything. So these are my like splurgy, fancy, nice, fancy, rich lady pieces, and I'm super excited about it. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Wow. I will say I'm a little sad I didn't get another like little like jewelry pouch. Is that the word I'm looking for? To like kind of put these in. Um, if I was like traveling, but since I do have the one, uh, what if I want to travel with all of them? Uh, I can't put both of those necklaces in there because they will entangle themselves with each other. But anyways, look how pretty! Oh my gosh! You know that song from Miss A? I don't need a man. You don't need a man to buy you nice jewelry, all right, y'all? I mean, it would be nice if you're not spending your own money on nice jewelry, but. It's also nice to just treat yourself. Oh my gosh. Put all the rings on. All of them. All of them at once. Gosh, I'm so, so happy. Wait, which one went with what? Okay, anyways. So pretty. Yeah, I'm just like a little bummed out. I don't have another like little jewelry bag thing. Satchet. Like, like it's not like a big deal right now because, you know, no one's traveling. But if I do travel, man, it would have been really nice to have a little, one of those little pouchies. But it's okay. I am so happy with everything. Everything is so freaking pretty. I, oh my gosh. I think that was another reason why I was waiting on their Black Friday. Because I'm like, well, I only have one piece from them so far. I kind of want to see what the other pieces I got from them would be like and kind of judge quality and everything before I buy more, <laughs> before I blow all my money and buy more. And you know what? I regret it. That is some FOMO right there. I really wish I could have snatched up their like space earring ones. And then once again, I missed out on getting their magic, like their Sailor Moon like earrings again. Of course, like, they're, they're big ones, not like they're stud ones, but I say big, they're not like big, they're still pretty dainty, but like they're, they're dangly Sailor Moon ones as opposed to just like that mixed stud pack that they released on Black Friday for pre-orders. Man, I now regret not spending like $500 on Be So Lovely on Black Friday. Oh, so much regret. These pieces are beautiful. I've loved literally every single one so far. Oh my god. I so regret it. Oh my god. Now here comes the FOMO. <sighs> it's fine. It's just jewelry. Jewelry. She will, will come out with more beautiful things, and she has come out with more beautiful things, so it's okay, Mina. You know, you'll be fine. I'm sure she will not abandon the magical girl inspiration. She will, no one can abandon the magical girl inspiration. <laughs> 
anyways, that's all I got. Um, I really love all of her pieces. They're oh so beautiful. I am going to wear them hopefully soon. I have to I have to fix my hands before I can wear these. Uh, what rings? I almost called them bracelets. My mind. I have to clean up my my hands. I really wish I could go traveling right now so I can like, go to Japan, get my nail through, put these rings on, and just be magical girl out a hundred, but yeah, I can't. Oh, you know what I should have worn for this video? I should have worn my uh, Black Lady, Wicked Lady, Dark Lady <laughs> uh, t-shirt that I got from Boy News a few years ago. Dang, I should have worn that. Anyways, if you have ever bought from Bisu Lovely, which I hope you have, and if you haven't, why not? Hello, if you're gonna buy some pretty nice spendy jewelry, highly recommend. You like magical girls, you like anime inspired things, you like classy jewelry, you like things that are anime inspired but not too literal or obnoxious. This is it. There's nothing wrong with literal obnoxious stuff. I have I have so many anime t-shirts, you guys. <laughs> I have Dragon Ball lace locks and Akatsuki Cloud lace locks and Sailor Mercury. <laughs> lace locks and <laughs> you saw the video <laughs> you saw it there's nothing wrong with having it over like anime fandom signaling but also it's also nice to have a more subtle anime piece here and there as well one that's more inspired instead of emblazoned yes i watched naruto throughout a large portion of my adolescence <laughs> you know i don't need that all the time so if you have not checked out Be So Lovely, I would highly recommend if you want some nice... Mm. How can I word their jewelry? Because it's not like costume jewelry, but it's not like precious jewelry. I guess it's like kind of fine jewelry. Is it kind of fine jewelry? Would you consider yourself fine jewelry? Kind of? It's kind of fine jewelry. Like in between? I don't know. I always. Mm. I guess I don't know the definitions for like jewelry types. I know it's not like costume or like fashion jewelry, you know, where it's like, oh, this is this, and it's not like these. Like, this is like fashion jewelry because it's enamel, you know? It's not like precious metals and such. Like, this has like gold plating and stuff, so it's like semi fine jewelry. I don't know. Anyways. If you're looking for cute, classy, really gorgeous pieces, definitely, definitely recommend Be So Lovely. And I love that they're so cute. Still so cute. Oh, so cute. And I love that they give like little prints. Like this. Like I think that's so cute. <laughs> so cute. Um, also definitely recommend supporting her, supporting the brand if you are looking for women-owned brands black owned brands, asian owned brands, because she is mixed, so if you're looking for some mixed kid representation, like me, definitely follow her, and follow her jewelry line, buy from her jewelry line, because it's amazing, it's fantastic, she creates beautiful things, she designs gorgeous pieces, and yeah, they are based out of Canada, so, just an FYI, if you are trying to buy it from anywhere else besides Canada, I am from the US, of course, like I've said before, I am from the upper midwest, so I'm pretty close to Canada. So this actually came out really fast. I think last time it shipped through USPS, but this time it shipped through FedEx, so it came, and it didn't, it went through FedEx and it didn't get handed off to my USPS, like, a lot of times FedEx does. But this made it here lovely, beautifully, safely. Thankfully, <laughs> beautifully, like always, and definitely did not disappoint. <sighs> definitely, definitely, definitely recommend supporting Be So Lovely, especially if you're looking for a women-owned brand, especially if you are here to support mixed kids. <laughs> also, if you want to support black-owned and Asian-owned, since she is both. Hey, hey. Uh, <laughs> and she loves magical girls in space, and that's same, same. <laughs> Uh, if I wear these, I gotta be careful. <laughs> I have worn my Inuyasha necklace to work a few times. I got compliments on it. 
by like a lot of people so so far it's going good but so i don't want to wear it too much to work i guess because i'm afraid i've had really rough luck with jewelry lately at work so <laughs> we'll see if i wear these often to work or not probably not i'll probably just wear them at home and just like be like my mom and be like look look, look. <laughs> my mom does that Anyways, enough of me rambling. Please support Be So Lovely. She does amazing things, amazing pieces. Fantastic. Fantastic. Her social medias are also really nice. I will link what I can down below, along with their websites. Um, yeah, I think that'll do her. Thank you so much for watching. If you have bought from Be So Lovely before, please let me know down below what you have gotten and how you like the quality and everything. If you've had their pieces for a while, let me know, and you wear them often, let me know how they wear. Let me know if you've noticed anything changing after wearing them for a long time or not, if they've still held up nicely or not. I would love to know. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Bye!